renovated it, so it was probably like just about the trashiest res on campus. Oh, doo 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 doo. Where does Austin live? Upper East Side, Manhattan, New York. Let me skip this, please. Tail is broad. Don't let her get away, but don't get spotted. I'll bring up the car behind you. Where does Rob live? Uh, right on the Gulf of Mexico in Houston, Texas. In a large sugar plantation. You're a real asshole, you know that? Did you eat that delicious lazy scholar? Yo, I didn't know we had so many uh, oil thigh Nabanrigans Nabanrigans K.I. in chat. You know I ate at the lazy scholar. You know I ordered that Angus with cheese, and then when I got up to the uh, the cashier, I told them it was a hummus sandwich, so I could pay two less dollars per lunch. The statute of limitations is probably expired on that, right? You gotta get the curlies, obviously. Phelpsy! I was just- I didn't want to sprint because I was worried she was going to catch me. They've ruined meal equivalencies now, thanks a lot, NL. Oh, come on. The Lazy Scholar is also where I got the buy one, get 11 free deal for Coca-Cola Black. Also, they used to sell soup. They probably Tail still do because it's like a deli. Don't but, let her get away, um, but don't get spotted. We would go I'll there and we'd buy like, you know, chicken strips and french fries. And then, uh, they had all these crackers that you're supposed to take if you got soup, right? But I would just take, like, six or seven packs of crackers every time. And then one day there was a note in the Lazy Scholar that was like, You can't take crackers unless you buy soup. And I was like, damn, my perfect crime. It's finally been revealed. I was like, this free crackers. Why wouldn't I? Coca-Cola Black was pretty not good. It was not Parnell soup. No, oh my god, this is actually stupid. No, cat, you don't No, I'm I can defeat it. Cat, you don't get to come in here. You know why? So I woke up 6, 7, 8 a.m. Have to go shh. This cat picking the carpet, being a real jerk about things. Tail is broad. Don't let her get away, but don't get spotted. I'll bring up the car behind you. There's nothing to talk about with the high rise up guy. So, uh, essentially, four weeks ago maybe, I walked into my class. High rise up was written on the whiteboard. Uh, I made a tweet and I was like, who wrote this? And then I got a, a DM on Reddit from a dude who was like, hey, I wrote it. I'm like in the full-time version of your program. I apologize if it was weird. And I was like, nah, it's not weird. And then he posted like an AMA on the subreddit. And I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. But then one of the mods deleted it. And I was like, you know, I can understand why they would do that. It might seem like it's kind of like personal information. And then he sent me another DM and it was like, sorry, I didn't realize. Oh, that's inconspicuous. Sorry, I didn't realize that it was uh, like a personal information sort of thing. And then I didn't reply because I was just like, I'm going to spend my whole life dealing with this high rib situation. But I was like, you know, feel free if, you, uh, if you're on campus. Come say hi, we could take a picture. And then I went to class on Friday and he said hi and we took a picture. Problem solved. That's it. That's the final story.
Get low. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Look for newspapers, telephones, shoe signs, stands, or window displays. Excuse me, I need to get into the shoe sign, shoe, shoe shine stand. Isn't this the guy who told me to shove off? Sorry, we gotta go. Sorry, sir. You, uh, bad service. You've lost a customer. Skirt. Risk losing the trail. To Baconist. Working as intended. Dude, I just appreciate. It takes a hundred percent focus for me to get through this section. Oh. she going? Oh, she was peeking. What are you talking about? She can't even see me. Oh. Oh, thank God. Okay, we hit a we hit a checkpoint. She did not have line of sight. And now, what are your thoughts on parasocial interaction? Here's a thought. Give me your lunch money, nerd. I don't know what that means. This cat, dude. What are your thoughts on bread? I think I've made my thoughts on bread very clear. I like bread a lot. It's probably my favorite uh, broad spectrum carbohydrate. Get low. tell the difference between your cats by their meows actually like infinity percent yes but it's not that like i know them like inside and out like some kind of dr doolittle situation ruka has very expressive meows tomos are actually just <coughs> so it's pretty easy to figure out who's who Yo, I'm incognito, dude. Tomo does have dolphin meows. This is a really fun section of this game. I understand the pressure for developers to always have a tailing section in their games. Maniac? Maniac, she says. Because literally, whenever you ask like anybody that plays video games what their favorite section of a game is, they go, I really love that part uh, where I had to tail somebody, but if I got arbitrarily too close, they spotted me, and if I got arbitrarily too far away, uh, they just vanish into the ether. Uh, everybody always goes, can I have more of the following sections in games, please? Can you give me more escort missions where uh, the person I'm supposed to tail walks 
faster than a walk, but slower than a sprint, so I have to constantly alternate back and forth between the, the two modes of transportation. Extreme stealth action. Opinion on that song that goes, She's a maniac, maniac. Uh, I've never seen Flashdance, so I only know it from, like, commercials. So I, I guess I can't give you a, uh, a real answer. For sale, Ruka. Dude. This cat is so annoying. No, 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 oh, God. So, Kate, I woke up at, like, uh... 7 a.m. because this cat knocked something over. He knocked over the freaking, like, rice accoutrements that you put on a, a bowl of rice to add a little color and crunchiness. I think he was trying to get to those sweet Japanese uh, cat food tubes that he's in love with. Yeah, the furikake, correct. He's not hungry. There's so much food. Bookmakers? Yes. Surprise, surprise. Oh, all right. <laughs> Here we are. <laughs> hey, uh, which room did they go into, my dude? Was it this one? That's the guy from the paper. Called that big cake. It's this one. Cole Phelps. A blonde woman just came in here. She went out the back way. Said she was being watched. How much did she Oh, collect? well, thank God I tried that 20 times. She claimed me out. On the Hammond Kid Galahad fight? You got it. I'm not complaining. We all made a lot of money on that one. Huge plunge on Galahad, and then Hammond knocks the bum out. <laughs> so she collected the money and went out through the back door. Nope. She made a phone call over there, wrote something on a notepad, and then left. What are you doing? An old intelligence trick from the Marines. Examiner Drugstore. 1487 Ivar Avenue, Ollie World. Come on. Come on, Cole. Just get the corner, my dude. We know where she's headed. Let's get moving. This guy just told him everything. He didn't even have to say that he was a police officer. You're behind the wheel. I love that that whole tailing going? section just existed so I could get a single more or single extra clue. That took me someplace else. Car 11 K 11 King. Further to your request, Bunko Fraud has three known bookmakers operating out of storefronts in the Hollywood area. Thrifty Liquor, 6106 Santa Monica, The Examiner Drugstore, and a Max Spirits at 16... What if it's Jollywood? Cherokee, KGPL clear. Old Marine's trick. Etching. Kick it down, Detectives Cole. Detectives Phelps and Earl, LAPD. Relax, Cole. You just have a blonde in here, Mervyn? Sure did. Oh, my God. I'm just about to close up. She took me to the cleaners. 4,000 <laughs> clams and change. How long ago did you leave? <laughs> Maybe five minutes. Called the cab. Asked for a number. I told her there was a card over there by the phone. <laughs> Is this guy okay? Is that his real voice? <laughs> hey, have you guys ever heard of cigars? They're pretty good. What do you think? She oh, left in a cab, grabbed the Lord. car, Now <laughs> that... That came out of nowhere. Yeah. 
Yellow cab. We need to get after her. Fast. Please don't make me leave so soon. Yo, the phone's ringing. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Yes, can I have a can 12 million cough, cough drops Hollywood delivered to this address, please? Seven, please? This is Detective Phelps, LAPD. You dispatched a cab to 1487 Ivar Avenue, Hollywood. Yes, sir. Send one round from the pool. Do you have the number of that cab? Number 179. Thanks. We're done playing around. Get Mervyn to give us an address on Ray's place. Who is Mervyn? Are you Mervyn? Any idea who Ray is? Sugar Ray. Not now, Mervyn. Cole doesn't have much of a sense of humor at the best of times. Also, literally no one can understand Ray a word you say. up on North Cherokee Avenue, just south of Hollywood Boulevard. Leave me alone, mister. I mind my own business. Look at how much smoke is in the air. You gotta get out of that glass box, man. You can drive. All right, where to? It does kind of sound like Steve-O. You're not wrong. Hammond He's hotboxing his whole life. And Candy is picking up the winnings. Smart play. Yo, what Question happened to is, the trunk? The Candy car is broken, behalf, dude. Or is she cheating him too? Slow down on these turns. All right. Yes. Hello. Yes, you're a cat. I know. Come in. Oh, now you want to leave? That's the cab waiting up ahead. She's not in the car. Don't get too close. She must be inside. We're on the move again, Cole. No. After her. Don't lose that cab. Hammond is over the hill. He's a punching bag for the up and comers. She knows God. I really just had to give her a little payback for earlier. Now we can play the we can play the real game. That's the cab waiting up ahead. She's not in the car. Don't get too close. She must be inside. One star? I don't deserve more than one star for this mission, dude. It's been terrible. I've only had to interrogate one person and we're well, still messing again, it up. Cole. After her. Don't lose that cab. Hammond is over the hill. He's a punching bag for the up and comers. She knows goddamn place. I think he knows. I think he worked out the place isn't LA. He's punchy, his brain's going to mush. Winston Churchill? Give me a break. Churchill is a fighter, Roy. Hammond didn't just scribble down the first name he could think of. Yeah, I mean, it's not like he wrote down Neville that would Chamberlain be a bad time or something. To forget how to drive. Nothing suspicious about this. Just leaving uh, 15 car lengths between me and the car in front of me. Thank you. Careful, we'll get spotted at this distance. Captain Salty. Oh, geez, easy there. You're driving like a Vancouver cab. Ooh. Just throw it into reverse on Ocean Avenue. No big deal. Seize the gap. You got a pretty funny idea of what keeping a low profile means, Phelps.
That bitch has given me what I'm owed. That's all I know. Who said that? Excuse me, sir. God darn it all. Easy, Cole. Better back it off. This, oh, yes. Better drop back, Cole. This is why tailing segments in games are the stupidest thing ever. Hey, drive as suspiciously as possible so they don't notice you. I know you're gonna say, oh no, it's just you being bad. Why am I winning then? Problem solved. Pull over. She's heading inside. All right, let's get one clue from this place and then leave again. We'll tail her in a biplane this time. I think I just saw Hammond. I'll tail him. You get in there and stay with Candy. Make sure you don't let. I him. got Candy. Skunk a dunk a dunk a dunk dunk. I used to be indecisive. Now I'm not so sure. Good one. Hilarious. Let me through. I just want a quick look. Cool Phelps, get down on the ground. Maniac. Excuse me? You get in there and keep an eye on Candy. Sorry. I guess, uh, got too close. Pull over. She's heading inside. Did he say make sure she doesn't see you? I think I just saw Hammond. I'll tail him. You get in there and stay with Candy. Make sure you don't let her see you. Yeah, okay. She did indeed. They did indeed indicate what that. Miss. Man, it's can you believe it's about all of this? Money. All this information contained in the newspaper? Wow. There's just like so Some much news the lately. Did you read about the woman who stabbed her husband and then pushed him in front of the car? Probably shouldn't. <laughs> oh! Someone, please! It's Cole Phelps! I apologize for being in here, but you know, it's the law. Roy! Call an ambulance. Hammond got away. <laughs> I'm extremely <laughs> realistically bleeding. He's said. Just Don't try and sit still, Candy. Who me. shot you? Was it out? Must be that time of the month? Wow. Get banned and also modded simultaneously. They're on the way. I have a patrolman searching the depot. The chief's putting together a manhunt for Hammond. He got the money, right? Looks like it. A tough bird, our limey friend. Using his girlfriend as the bag woman and then getting greedy over the split? It he was Rusty's razor. Town. That's how you see it? I told you that cocksucker was a crook. Just pull the flush. I just want to see what happens. Just pull the flush, Phelps. Phelps, pull the flush. Squid, do, 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 do. Oop. Squib, dip. Squib. Squid it. Squid it. Okay. 32 caliber. One shot fired. Spin it. Spin the barrel. Like McCree. It's the other half to that movie ticket. The Egyptian theater. So, what now? The theater, I guess. We don't have much else to go on. Can we go out through the window? I'm jumping through the window. I'm letting everything go. Car's out here. I'm jumping out the window. Oh yeah, just leave the corpse there? I will call somebody. You drive. This is the most the locations in any Fine. case Where ever. Are we headed? Poor girl. She
She didn't deserve that. She did lie to Poor us. Poor girl. Half the precinct aren't taking a vacation this year because of her. You need to leave town a lot quicker than that if you decide to screw over Mickey C. And now, how good would Phelps be in a PUBG environment? Let's go over the facts. First off, always has headgear appropriate to the situation. That's a big plus. Secondly, he can take eight shots in the chest without going down. Thirdly, runs so fast no blue could conceivably catch him. Thirdly, and this aka like fourthly, a shot. Um, Aren't they best driver in Los Angeles. Car 11 King. Message from the coroner. The cause of death was a knife wound. Repeat, a knife wound. The revolver appears to have belonged to the victim. KGB Son of a bitch. He stabbed her. I thought you said real men use their fists, not guns. That guinea cocksucker. I don't even know you what that means. You think he got means. the money too? Come on, Roy. We're bringing this whole tragedy to its conclusion. You let the other guy drive all the time, though? Yeah, so he gets practice. Why'd you kill her, Carlos? Your gripe was with me. She was collecting the money for you. Mickey made it clear it was either me or you, and, and I intend to keep on living. She's 